Hey guys, good evening everybody. I'm Chief Meteorologist Patrick Bigby. Let's take a look at your forecast as we go into uh, the tropical update here. And right now we're watching two areas. One of them is the former uh, remains of Gordon and has a 20% a chance of developing over the next couple of days. It's being torn apart by wind shear, which is just tearing apart the system. You can see how all the clouds are being streamed off towards the east. Eventually to move out of this wind shear and it could reform back into Gordon uh, with a 50% chance of doing that in the next seven days. But we're also going to watch this area down into the Caribbean. Hurricane Center is giving this a 20% chance of formation, but it could move northward as we go into next week. Now this really won't form until next week, so all weekend we'll have a chance to watch it. But if it does form, it could move into the Gulf of Mexico where it goes, uh, the, the strength and intensity. All remains a question along with the question, does it even form in the first place? We've seen the models play this game before, and uh, so it's something that we're going to watch uh, over the next couple of days. I want to compare these two models. This is the European model in the yellow wind particles, and then the GFS wind particle in the red particles. And as you can see, the GFS shows a tighter, probably more intense system uh, north of Mexico Thursday, and then uh, the European just shows a broad area of low pressure out into the western Gulf of Mexico, which will most likely be a weaker system. Now, the GFS is been all over the place with this thing it's really uh it's taken it from where it is now it, it's it's thrown it up to panama city it's thrown it up to tampa it's thrown it up to the big band area of florida and this is why i'd say don't look at one model run and think that's what's going to be uh the actual uh you know the, the actual thing that's going to happen it's it's a guidance not the gospel so it's something that we're going to continue to watch future cast shows that developing and if it were to form uh helene would be the next name on the list and so we'll continue to monitor that but for right now the bottom line don't panic just keep checking in we'll continue to keep you updated and when uh, it does decide that it looks like it's gonna uh, get ready to form we'll be sure to let you know because of course that's why we're the first alert weather team